Germany is unable to free itself from shackles of socialism, censorship, and political oppression. Dear Mother Merkel ruined German culture, brought violence and terrorism and genocide, and sold her nation's rest sovereignty to the totalitarian EU. And despite abusing her own people as Nazis and humiliating them with globalist propaganda, a euphemism for cultural Marxism, her delusional electorate voted her into power again. For the fourth time. Greetings from Kim Jong-un. You can't teach democracy to Germans. Merkel with Obama, it cannot be that a certain group say, we are the people, and the rest is not the people. For that I was not happy in the GDR, East Germany, at that time, that the people had something to say. Do you even imagine how brainwashed these idiots must be? They're watching 24-7 regime TV A.R.D. ZDF, and consume that awful propaganda press site, FAS, Suadach, and Spiegel. You can't help them. They are done with brains, and most of them probably deserve to be thrown under the migrant bus. How do you explain democracy to German students if dear Supreme Leader Merkel is in power for 1616? years. Everybody in the classroom must be laughing. They don't know a Germany without Merkel. Let us see who else is calling itself democratic. East Germany called itself democratic. East Germany, a communist country and Soviet satellite state, the German Democratic Republic. Ha 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 ha. Merkel was East German cadre back then. North Korea calls itself democratic. Oh, look at this. North Korea also calls itself democratic, what a surprise. The Merkel Party calls itself democratic. So, this is the Merkel Party, the CDU, the Christian Democratic Union. You've got to be shitting me. It looks like dictatorships have the surge to sneak in the term democratic just so to mock the people. Do you smell the stink? Yes, it is always the dictators and despots who officially brand themselves as democratic. Back to the German classroom. Don't even bring up the post-war German regimes. Could it be that the post-war German regimes were US-selected puppet regimes wasn't Konrad Adenauer chosen as the local magistrate to play to the tune of his US foreign masters? Merkel for her part shamelessly flew in US President Barack Obama to support her election campaign twice. 